We're talking about arugula, everyone. We all like it. Mm-hmm. In other countries, it's called rocket. Did you Nuh-uh. know that? In the UK, they call it rocket. Abubula? That's cool. How about that? Oogula boogula. It's a cooler name than arugula. that's for. What? What that kind of lettuce is for? Oogula boogula? Arugula boogula? You guys remember that bitch? Uh... <laughs> it's racist. Oh, okay. <laughs> I thought you were being silly. You guys yeah, what are these that? guys have, having a salad over here? What's in it? Arugula boogula? <laughs> remember that bitch? Uh... <laughs> well, we got a couple of guys having a, an arugula boogula salad over here. <laughs> I'm not even sure who that's racist towards. I don't know. It's like a concept. It's like a, there's like a. It's an amorphous There's racist. a guy walking okay. past a construction site and some black guys are eating their salad for hey. lunch. Oh, okay. And there he goes. He goes, hey, get a load of this. What are these guys eating for lunch? A arugula boogula salad? <laughs> he's just elbowing one of those like Bangladeshi <laughs> police officers. Oh, yeah. He's like, so like the tickets? Yes. Can you please help me find pants that fit? <laughs> yeah, why are they all in like a they're, fucking they're uniform? Dad's yes, it looks like a child, <laughs> oh, dude. Yeah. yeah, it's really strange. A little boy playing policeman. And the hats are the, big too. Yeah. I think that the police tailor is like a big prankster. Yeah. I think that uh, he's like the, he's like I'm going to make these Take this you fucking Indian. Yeah, I don't <laughs> think he likes South the tailor, Asian. The tailor of Panama. <laughs> yeah. You remember are, are meter maids cops in New York? They seem like they're not. None of those people seem like real cops to me. I think they're cops, yeah. There's no distinction? They seem soft. It seems like... Do well, they have yeah, guns? It's, it's always, like, traditionally an old lady cop job. Yeah, or, like, a frail, like, or, fresh off the boat. What I want is, yeah. is beater yeah. maids, and it's a cop that's like, Sir, if you're gonna park there, you gotta let me beat you off. <laughs> I'm like, well, fair. fine, but I'm in a rush. <laughs> if that's how the system is set up... If that's how President Andrew Yang wants it, <laughs> so be it. But I'm in a rush, so please yeah. kiss my neck while you do it. Yeah. <laughs> President, <laughs> President Andrew Yang is like, in addition to anime body pillows. That's not what he sounds just, like. <laughs> available is. for is, everybody. Yeah. Everybody gets an anime body pillow. Yeah. Wait, but he really talks also, like that? Yeah, learn English, Yang. Yeah. Yeah. That's, that's my... Yeah, but we will also be introducing beta maids instead of the Paris. No, yeah. Everyone says the Paris are racist. But what if the Paris... Only job was to beat off your penis. Yeah. <laughs> that way, when you get in trouble, an ugly woman beats you off. <laughs> and it's punitive because no one believes in the psychological uh-huh. trauma that happens to men when they're taken advantage of by an ugly woman. Yep. <laughs> that way, it's laughable. And it also has a built-in way of correcting the issue of sexual assault and how it's not treated fairly oh, based on gender. Thank so you. Yang's Thank idea you, is Yang. to just rape men more. So you use ugly female <laughs> cops to rape white men. Yeah. And this is part of my genius <laughs> it's computer a guy strategy to fix the country. Yeah. And then I everyone has you... to be like, hi, ah, you know, I guess he has a point. I guess it's, it's this one weird Chinese guy that's figured out everything. He's developed a system that works for everybody. I love how you're using that classic Yang upstate New York accent. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Oh, listen, I'll I, think that I think that's where he's from. <laughs> Is he from? I think he's from, like, Rochester. Going up in Rochester. Oh, so you were joking also, Adam. He doesn't sound like no, that. No, he's... Of course he doesn't sound like that. I don't know. His I've parents are from speak. Taiwan, yeah. but yeah. He's, <laughs> he's running for president, I, which I was means that born, he had to have been born in I was born and raised in Syracuse. <laughs> You're right. That is a good point. He has to be over 35. Well, he doesn't have to be raised here. He needs to be born here. Mm-hmm. Yeah. He could have been born here and taken fucking back to... Was he also Cruz born in Canada, right? He could also be pulling a... Uh, uh, Beto O'Rourke and just chooses to sound like that. That's, That's true. true. No one's going to stop Culture. it. Uh, you know, that'd be less cultural mm-hmm. appropriation than Beto. Yeah. yeah. That's I want to run, as, I wanna yeah. run as, as Ding Dong Mullen. <laughs> you know? Oh, no. Just, <laughs> oh, fuck. Just like, uh, yeah. You know, down in Texas, <laughs> we have an expression. It's, uh, 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 you, uh, you fool, fool me once, once I yeah. pee in your Coca Cola. <laughs> 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 when they look back on the past, they are going to say, "Do we know who are these? Who are these Japanese scum that passed this <laughs> Donald Trump plan? We don't want to be like those nip scum." <laughs> Man, I miss being a little, a little youngin. A little youngin, huh? Man, I, can, I remember my daddy. He called me. He called me sucking on his nuts while he was asleep. <laughs> Made me suck. He said, "You gonna sit here? You gonna suck the whole nuts. dick? Mm-hmm. You gonna suck my whole dick?" And I never sucked another. And it damn. made it made me sick. But I yeah, man, I had to I had to go to school. We had in chorus class. Everybody's laughing at me because my vocal cords was bruised. 
Mm, that's why you talk that way. Not, uh, yeah, I thought yeah. it was cigarettes. Oh no, I'm, I mean my parents. I'm first generation Taiwanese. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah, no, nah, my, my <laughs> yeah, my vocal cord. Hey, good afternoon. My name is presidential candidate Andrew Yang. I think you mean mayoral candidate. <laughs> mayoral candidate Andrew Yang. Andrew Yang. That's the thing I love about New York. Going into Bodega. <laughs> Stop with that, man. <laughs> Going into Bodega. Sc- you sc- <laughs> that is and he it. said, let me get a chirp cheese <laughs> and put a good extra sun mm-hmm. on it. We can either let me get it. extra sun on it, t- chopped cheese, <laughs> and down it, down the job. And the chopped cheers. <laughs> yeah. Like, Shop hey, man, are you okay? Nah, I'm having a stroke. <laughs> we can either right have, what was it? We can have Look, cashews I got the, or there, issues? There are two things you need to know about me. <laughs> oh, got, I'm, got, a bus I'm from Taiwan, <laughs> and I'm having a stroke. <laughs> you want, we have cashews uh, come, or issues. You know, we come have curshews or urshies. <laughs> <laughs> come down here and bust nuts. <laughs> you want to come bust nuts with me? Then we ain't got no problem. <laughs> but we're going to have a problem, then it's going to be dirt. We're going to have wordlums. We're gonna have word word. I look. I don't got. I don't got word problems. I got action problems. So true. You know what, I'm Mr. Saying? Yang? The question In was Ma- about school vouchers. This, the vouchers will be redeemed for Bitcoin. I already <laughs> said that. I already said we don't need no damn schools if you just give if the kids cryptocurrency. If you got yup mm-hmm. currency, that's they got cryptocurrency, but they ain't got no blood row currency. That's the problem is that they uh. ain't no balance to it. <laughs> there needs to be more violence in the mm-hmm. uh, crypto market. Look, a lot of people they don't trust me because they know I said the N word throughout my throughout my teen years. Mm. But you have to understand that was an act of endearment. That makes him the most uh, most New York candidate possible. If yeah. he's a Chinese, if as a Chinese yeah. teenager he said the N word, that's. We're, yeah, have you Queens take, is crawling with those. Guys. Have you taken the subway? Have you to taken the seven? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> All it is is Chinese kids. You know why they call Caesar's it the seven? Close your eyes. Saying the N word. You know they, they call it the seven because I grew up on the seven. You know what I'm saying? I'm Chinese. I'm from Flourishing. <laughs> <laughs> and I grew up on the seven. They call it the seven because there's seven letters you say when you on that train. Yeah. N-I-G. No. no. <laughs> I don't think that's why they call it that. Yes, it is. Yeah. You think it's, they think it's the seven train is named after the letters it's, in the N word? It, no. It's, the number of it's letters? It's N-I-G-A-F-A-G. Mm. <laughs> I don't think that's the seven true. Left, that's on my license plate. <laughs> <laughs> Mr. Yang. Wait, I'm sorry, Mr. Yang. That's Are you number. saying that your license plate? I got a. So I, you, you got two a van- slurs. You got a vanity. <laughs> I got a Toyota. I got a stretch limousine Toyota Avalon with N I G A F A G on the license, the license plate. Wow, that's, that's pretty. That's bad for the city. To that's drive fucked a, up. Man. And I you got, got a the parallel whole, perk. That we got. Look, you know how they got moon roofs? This thing, the, the entire top glass, mm-hmm. uh-huh. and then there's a Shark Tank above nice. it. So oh, nice. Above when you it. look it up, you just see. Shorts. <laughs> That's awesome. You just see it, and you would drive around the avenues, <laughs> rubbing down the city in the avenues, and oh, you no. looking up at sharks eating all the buildings. Mm-hmm. So I'm sorry, is that? And that's where I, that's a, that's called the dollar bill money mentality. Is it? Is it a little? <laughs> that's, called, that's called the cash dollar bu- dollar bill. So, <laughs> so is it a very high and, Avalon, or are you smushed under the the? Yeah, uh, it'd it be aquarium. on it'd be on eighty twos. Okay, on, you got eighty two. No, okay, I understand. So it's high. Mm-hmm. But mm. would, does that give you enough space to sit yes. if you're behind, under the but aquarium? Hold on, let me explain something to you. Yeah, because mm-hmm. I don't think you understand what we're seeing. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I, I don't. I think I think you have a bit of a comprehension problem. I'm ha- I am. <laughs> I'm having a hard time comprehending the layout of this limousine. The, it's on eighty twos. But that only makes it higher. <laughs> it's on it doesn't make the actual <laughs> inside <laughs> it's on taller. It's on eighty twos. <laughs> But the car will be sitting in the middle of the tires, okay. so but down uh, low. So it's it's hung. The it's tires slung. are higher than the, the car. tires are higher than the car, <laughs> and the tires drag the car along the ground. Okay, all right. So the car you got it dropped. You look, still got it. Look, look, I don't look, understand. So I'm having even a harder time the car, understanding. The now. car got a snow. They got, they got like a train mm, plow a, on the front. Okay, a cow pushes. <laughs> it's a train plow. And so that digs into the streets. Destroy, so, yeah. Oh, I see. You're destroying the street. It destroys in street, the street shark style. And they stole the idea from me. Uh, street That's shark. what I was. Yeah. I was the first N I G F A G on the block <laughs> okay. that had a car. Please stop saying but that. But I'm Chinese. I'm Mr. from Flourishing. Yeah. That's <laughs> it. Just, it's, 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 come on, growing man. up in Flourishing. Okay. <laughs> 
we would all call each I other. I think you're from upstate New York. We would call, <laughs> I'm, from, look, I'm first generation Taiwanese, so <laughs> pardon me if I'm calling my friends N-I-G-F-A-Gs. Okay. <laughs> right. Please stop I have a question it. just to change uh, tracks. But so Candidate we, I, say I was the first person to be destroying the streets with a bunch of sharks on top of my car. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and then that show came out, and I said, I said, I said, what? <laughs> I said, hold on a damn minute, moaning. So, candidate Yang, there's been a lot of. Uh, so I ain't seen, I, 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 I ain't seen nothing like that in the hot pot before. I've been, go ahead. In the hot pot. So I'm sorry. There's been a there's been a lot of uh, anti Chinese and That's Asian true. sentiment after the coronavirus, which, uh, as, as you know, what, the what are you talking about? I don't even know. There's well, there's been there was a virus that uptick. came from Wuhan in China. No, I don't know nothing about that shit. Anyway, so <laughs> we're, we're trying to do is think about like eBay, but for pussy. <laughs> <laughs> Woo! The crowd is going wild. <laughs> Andrew Yang with a landslide victory in the mayoral <laughs> primary, <laughs> with running on the platform of eBay for pussy. <laughs> Everybody trying to be a search worker right now, but. If you're trying to be a search worker and you ain't got your shit searched, then mm. you in for suck. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. If you ain't searched, you suck. <laughs> That's true. That's what I'm saying. Like, because we got Bust a lot of... Nuts. You know, they be thinking that be people outside of New York be thinking that's for Jews only. <laughs> right. Uh-huh. But, you know, the reality is it increases the sensation. Uh, not getting searched. Yeah. Okay, I love it, Andrew Yang. Everyone who's from look, if you got Baltimore look, and Oakland, it look, sounds like at the same time. Let me let me let me explain. Let me explain you something. <laughs> let me explain something to you. Yes, they look. You got a hat on, and uh-huh. you go outside. How's that feel on your head? The uh, weather, the wind. Imagine wind. I can't is really pussy. feel the wind. Imagine wind. You can't feel it. Okay, so the wind is. But pussy. you take the hat off. And now you got pussy all over your motherfucking face. Oh, the wind is <laughs> pussy, pussy. pussy dripping down but I thought, on your shirt. <laughs> Which is, sounds awesome. That's but, why I want to take it a step further. I'm trying to get all the skin taken off my penis and turd. <laughs> Oh, wow, that sounds painful. I'm trying to have I'm trying to have my shit inside earth. I thought you were for <laughs> un, uh, you were against circumcision. I've changed my mind. <laughs> okay, oh, somebody said, it. look, somebody <laughs> sent me some literature <laughs> on the earth shoot, uh-huh. and now my my position has changed, <laughs> has evolved. My, you could even say my position has become circumcised. <laughs> oh, okay, all right, it's been turned inside earth <laughs> because that, of the metaphor of a hat, a hat on your head. And wind being pussy. Is that even, what turned it around? I don't for even you? think about it because that's how you know Jews be doing that shit with everything. You know, that's uh-huh. true. You wear a hat to hide the fact that you're going bald. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. And so the Jews <laughs> said, "Why don't we just cut it down to the part where you're actually bald? Yeah, yes. and then we can get when we can feel all Smart. that pussy wind on our on ears, our hair, on our hair, but yeah. not on our bald head. <laughs> where it would bald, slide bald. off. You want the rest of the hair <laughs> growing? You wild. want the hair saturated? Yeah, yeah. Pussy. Just a wet pussy. <laughs> yeah, like a small hat. <laughs> yeah." A small hat to cover, to the, cover bald part. the bald part. Yeah. Because pussy juice can be corrosive to the skin. And they're yeah. just doing the same shit with the cocks. That's awesome. You know what? You've, you Honestly, Mr. Yang, you have turned my... You got my vote. You've turned me around on that. Yeah, I know we're issue. supposed to be the moderators and be uh, objective, but, but... Between eBay for pussy... <laughs> And uh, getting uh, pussy ju- he wind had me juice. eBay for pussy. He had me there as well. Yeah, yeah. Now, what about the issue of um, child molestation? Child molestation. Yeah. yeah. What about How that? As about that? We're like, no. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my bus. <laughs> my bus. <laughs> What, you got, what do you mean? What is my your take? My bus. We no, gotta my bus. Back. We got to bring my bus. Move on, please. <laughs> okay. Next question. Um, what about an occupancy tax? <laughs> Oh, is that your next tell? <laughs> Where are you at? Who's next telling you? <laughs> Sorry, I'm just you know, my shit blowing up. I'm trying to. I'm not. I'm not. I'm, I'm be trying to interrupt, mm-hmm. Mr. Uh, Kamala over here. Mm-hmm. That's but, just. A, that's not. What do you mean, Mr. Kamala? That's just a black guy. I'm just. I'm just trying to. Uh, you know, my shit be blowing up, but it's. It's. Oh, it's. It's just different. Bitches. Yeah, Mr. Kamala oh, in real life is a Jewish guy. It's not even a black guy like he. Never mind. Wait, is the guy? Is there a guy named Mr. Kamala? In well, this, in this situation, Kamala. I'm on a debur stage, yeah. and we're debating, and I'm interrupting somebody's answer about pretending girls are blowing up my phone. Oh, I see, I see. <laughs> That's, so it's not girls. It's not the phone. It's not guys. Even me. It's me. Oh, you're noise. calling oh. yourself. It's me making a noise with my mouth. Oh. What do you? What do you have to? <laughs> Thanks for being honest, Mr. Yang. Please wait. My shit blurring up. Uh, it's not blurring. It's up, blurring sir. it. 
We can see your phone. It is not lighting up. And it's bitches that got their pussy whore from my pernis. <laughs> <laughs> and I, that might not sure well with some of you. <laughs> Mr. You, Yang, where did you pick this accent up from exactly, and what is it? Yeah, is this uh, <laughs> It's a traditional Turwanese accent. Oh, no, this is from Turwan. Yeah, I'm from Turwan. I'm sorry. Yeah, I had yeah. no idea. I had no idea, <laughs> sir. Yeah, the doctor says it's uh, brain cancer. <laughs> <laughs> the doctor says I got a benign tumor mm. that's grown to half the size of my skull. Wow. But it's benign. Right. I told them benign. How about you suck this benign in a half? Mm hmm. That's very funny. <laughs> Thank you, Mr. Yang. I'll give him that. That's very funny. <laughs> but he's got problems with redistricting. So <laughs> you shouldn't vote for that man. Okay. Okay, okay. How many motherfuckers are running? I'm bringing back bananas in pajamas, but this time you can see they they're circumcised. <laughs> you can see their penises. The top of the now, let me ask they're you this: peeled the down top of the banana bit. been peeled down. Oh, so yeah. wait, they're all the. You're telling me you're revealing that the bananas and pajamas are actually <laughs> two cocks, two giant cocks. No, they're bananas. Oh, <laughs> but it's a metaphor. I see. I see. That's yeah. what makes art good. Is Do you think some metaphor. people might think what you're saying is like that if the bananas are penises? I, look, so like if I just said oh it's about a polar express it's about a train that goes mm -hmm. to the north pole that would be gay but it, when you say the train is actually about like the mentality of lifestyles <laughs> <laughs> that's how you know are you a big robert zemeckis animation uh, fan that's how you know it's a genius that's the dollar bill cash mentality dollar bill cash money mentality of course <laughs> wow <laughs> it's about executive styles of life management between that's the dollar right. bill cash money mentality and being chinese and saying the n-word that locks up a lot of new york mm -hmm. yeah yeah and if he flips on circumcision that's three of the biggest Mm. Oh the yeah, biggest. then you got the Orthodox Jews. You got then. Jews. You got Chinese. You know what I'm teenagers. saying? You know they got circumcision, but I'm trying to get smirkumcision. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, I'm trying to get smirk, oh, like smirkumcision. Like like so you want to smile? Yeah, I said carve my shit up so it looks like my dick is like, what's up, man? It's smirking. <laughs> hey, how you doing, man? You want you want your <laughs> penis yeah, I got my shit in size. You want your penis to look like uh, yeah, they cut Heath the whole, Ledger and the Joker without got, his makeup. So the lip, the hole, the slit, it's got one. It's like the <laughs> cheeks coming up on one. side. It's yeah, like, hey, I see you. I see you. <laughs> oh, and that way you'll come. Okay. You'll come in sort of a crescent moon shape. Yeah, and I got on the side like a shark mouth tattooed. On me. <laughs> oh yeah, you're into sharks. <laughs> like, like, a, like a sailor Jerry, like a girl. <laughs> yeah, that says it ain't over till the fat lady turns. Oh wow, <laughs> but she's not fat. The girl. Yeah, the girl. No, she's fine as shit. I'm she's fucking fine. that. That's the girl. Yeah. I'm fucking the fine girl. The fat bitch is just she's some bitch. That she sings. Some, yeah. That's yeah. how you, you know when shit's done. Because back in the day in the factory they used to hire a fat bitch to sing at the end of the. Day. Oh, that's where that expression. That's when it was quitting time. That's where that expression comes. The expression. From. The expression because it was the boss's wife. Mm. She'd be like, "Hey, I'm trying to. I'm thinking about becoming like a celebrity and trying to sing." <laughs> and she would try, and everybody'd be like, "We got to get the fuck out of here." Yeah, yeah. That's this fat bitch ain't nobody trying to fuck her ass. And now she <laughs> pretends she's talented. <laughs> She pretended she talented instead of just just. I had uh, no idea. Just big. Thank you, Mr. Yang. Uh, mm. Once again, you've gone over your time by forty-five <laughs> minutes. No one is here anymore. <laughs> just... All right, don't forget that shit. The most important takeaway: I invented street sharks. <laughs> Damn, it would be awesome if uh, if that's what Andrew Yang sounded like. Mm -hmm. Then he would. Then I would vote for him. Oh, Do you remember when definitely. Andrew Yang was first running and I did a Chinese voice and you were like, "Is that what he said?" <laughs> yeah, I never heard him talk. It was possible. Oh, what was it? No, Something in bear rice. No, it's not possible. <laughs> Nick was doing like his hardcore Chinese accent. <laughs> it's, like, it's not. You know, Why is it not possible? Because it's you, not possible. You guys are racist for thinking that, not me. Mm -hmm. I'm the kind of guy that thinks America's ready for a guy that talks like that <laughs> to be president. I don't know if we are. You're not. I'm what ready. <laughs> I'm ready. I don't know if America's ready. I, that's the kind of guy I am, though, yeah. that I, I'm giving America the benefit of the doubt. Well, I'm ready to hear his voice mm -hmm. and then know what it sounds like. Who who the fuck else is running for, for mayor? Uh, Some chicks. I want to I wanna get Andrew Yang on the, the podcast. You wanna, we probably on could. On our podcast? Yeah. I think it's possible. He, he did could. Rogan. Yeah. Yeah. And that's we're like, true. we're just as big. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we have basically the same. Maybe a little bit bigger. We're bigger than Rogan, yeah, for yeah. sure. Yeah. Um, but we're more Yang's audience. Are we? Oh, yeah, dude. All right, guys. We could get the Yang gang. 
I bet you 95% of the people that listen to this podcast. Is it all right, guys? I thought it's... Um... I don't fully dislike him. I know, like, I just, like, everybody hates him just because, like, it's, it's a lot of his... I don't like have universal anything. UBI shit is like it seems like it's just a way to gut entitlement programs, but mm-hmm. and then I guess he's oh like would there also, be no entitlement programs if they're under UBI? Well, he said some things, and he like he leans more in that direction when he was he did like Rubin report, and then on Rogan he kind of said a couple of things that were like, you know, if you give people the option of like a thousand dollars or or you know uh uh you know your food stamps uh, obviously they're going to choose a thousand dollars so he wants to do it on some nixon shit of just give them money don't do like you know yeah don't have programs yeah and he's like honestly it's better for the economy and it's like yeah because people will spend like additional income but mm-hmm. like you want to make sure that they have food and health care yeah it's also like i don't even understand i but like he supports does he support Universal health care? I don't know player. if it's clear. No idea, dude. Yeah. I don't, that, I don't even know how the fuck you value that. Because he's talking about if you already get like $1,000 worth uh, or $500 a month in benefits, but I don't know how you like value, right? you know, yeah. health care. Yeah, I, I don't know. I don't, I don't know. Specific. I, honestly, I stopped How many Zans do you debates. get a month under that plan? For 1000 bucks, Street value or? <laughs> no. From the pharmacy. That's how you value it. How many? How much Adderall and Xannies you can get? The only two reasons to have use healthcare. Uppers and downers. Yeah. We streamline it. We some just give everyone bring me Adderall. Up, some to put me down. Exactly. The sorority diet. <laughs> That's right. It's also dumb because like everyone gets the money, so it's like even rich people. Yeah. If you're if you well yeah if you're like an upper middle class person you get the thousand dollars and it's like those people will be able to spend the money they probably won't they'll probably just put it in the savings yeah, account. Yeah, they'll put it. In, yeah. yeah. It, 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 they'll it'll invest just, it. Yeah. I mean, and then like well that. People make that argument about healthcare. It's like, why should rich people get free healthcare? And it's like, which is so. Do you want to have something? Yeah, that's, that, yeah, that's completely different. I mean, it's it's why? not extra money. It's healthcare. Right. It's yeah. like you wouldn't make that argument about like, well, why do rich people get the fire department? Well, he his <laughs> the UBI the <laughs> extra money that can be used in many different ways when it gets put back into the economy. It would but be it's funny. still an entitlement program, a UBI, no? Yeah, but but it's the difference in how the money functions. What about universal basic inches? And Here's we the all thing: get if you give somebody, if you give somebody who doesn't need it an additional twelve thousand dollars a month, and like that immediately goes or twelve thousand dollars a year, yeah, and that uh, like immediately just goes into like interest bearing savings account. I mean, it's like free money, so why not put it in like high risk investments or, or you know, mm-hmm. it's just like extra money. Whereas yeah. poor people immediately have to spend that money on like yeah, going to. S- Getting shoes and Whatever shit. those... Well, not even shoes. It's like if, if it is like gutting those programs... Oh, food and like the then, doctor. Then yeah. it goes on those essentials or into those essentials or whatever. And mm-hmm. it's effectively like nullified any benefits they get. Meanwhile, people that like do already have wealth are able to turn that $12,000 into even more money for themselves in a way that doesn't benefit the economy. Right. Mm-hmm. I mean, marginally by like, you know, investing in companies or whatever and it helps their growth, but not in the same way that like... You know, if you give poor people a thousand dollars on top of like like the uh, like the Bush stimulus, right? Mm-hmm. Where yeah. it was just an additional check rather than like le- less withholding, that mm-hmm. money went back into the economy. But it's not like at the expense of like, hey, if you want this six hundred dollar check, you lose your food stamps. You right. know, you still have all like the basic needs met, and then if you have like a- additional like disposable income or whatever, uh-huh. then you-, you can spend that <clears throat> on like a fucking. On just, you know, like a TV or whatever the fuck you, you know, want on top of that. And that is good for the economy. Yeah. Universal bitch insurance. And if you're not getting pussy, yeah, you can file a claim to hire a prostitute. And they, they have to pay for it. And for the, no, well, the, yes, it's you make, covered. You have a deductible. You have a deductible, <laughs> but you would reach it pretty quickly. Yeah. Because you're constantly trying to get pussy. What do you guys think about that? It's not a bad idea. Thank you. But I don't know. I mean, I feel like people hate Andrew Yang, and I don't, like, get why. Yeah, I, I couldn't feel believe, like I, the, the I was, Yang I'll, gang stuff has died down. I was shocked he was, like, in the de- I guess they're letting everyone in the debates. But he's actually pulling better than all those random fucking shitty, like, that dickhead that looks like Bennett Beans. And beans from Even mm-hmm. Stevens. Who's the bald <laughs> guy? Oh. Uh, John Delaney. Del- yeah. yeah. Is yeah, he from yeah. Maryland? <laughs> yeah. I, mm-hmm. That's how much of a loser he is. And I don't know who the fuck that guy is. And I was sort of, when I was younger... Kind of into pop. I even was like, yeah, yeah. In the Maryland, he's also hella rich. Oh, is he? Yeah, I think he's. I've never heard of this guy. 
Yeah, he's he just, must be from Howard County right, or some bullshit. Yang 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 pulls like at the same like he's he's up by Gillibrand and shit. He's got yeah. Like he a actually pulls. He's at what like two percent or something? Yeah, yeah one or three percent. Yeah. Who's that other guy with like the gray hair that I've also that Bernie said that all, put his nuts in his mouth? Where he's uh, like I wrote the bill or whatever. Who's that guy? Oh yeah, they're all like the same Who guy. Who the fuck are those? Tim guys? Ryan. Oh, Tim Why Ryan, are they still yeah. in the? Tim like... Ryan looks like a serial killer. Yeah, he's yeah. got like the BTK killer's eyes. You know that Michael Bennett, who just sounds like fucking uh, uh, Cameron doing an impression of Sloane's father in, in yeah. Ferris Bueller's Day Off. <laughs> yes. <laughs> My daughter will be outside at three p.m. <laughs> <laughs> Michael Bennett. Is that... what, what, what's the principal's name? Uh, Listen, Jeffrey Jones, ped- famous pedophile Jeffrey Jones. Oh, I just watched the Deadwood movie. They brought him back, but they didn't give him any dialogue. Yeah. Yeah, but it's hilarious. Mike, you see a, him in the he's background. A pedophile? He's a convicted pedophile. My, yeah, he's a convicted <laughs> pedophile. He was making his own child porn. Oh, man. Yeah, yeah. But Ferris, David you Milch are to has... be in school at <laughs> 10 a.m. Does that, movie, that movie is so much funnier when you like know that Jeffrey Jones is a pedophile that took guys on Oh, Ferris it makes school. it even better. It was yeah. like, I got, I'm going to get my hands on him. <laughs> <laughs> Wait a second. Is he, was he in other shit? Is he like the fa- is he that famous guy who's like yeah. he's he a redhead the- guy who's the principal in Ferris Bueller's and that guy yeah he was in uh, Deadwood oh as the guy well. that got fat and shit and had a little mustache and bald and shit I guess he was fat oh he was no. he played the newspaper guy in Deadwood yeah that's the guy I'm thinking of yeah. <laughs> Oh, that yeah. sucks, dude. But David Milch has has enough respect for his product to As bring him actor. back for the movie. You couldn't have found another fat guy that looks like it's that? It's so funny to have the pedophile back but not give him any lines. Yeah. <laughs> or he says, like, one-off things, but he doesn't have any dialogue. Oh, my God. <laughs> That's... Yeah, that is definitely... That definitely heightens the movie. <laughs> where he's yeah, chasing a high him. school boy. Oh, yeah, oh, Ferris Bueller, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, guys, Beto just dropped out. <laughs> About fucking time. That's surprising. And, but he will not run for Senate. <laughs> what a fucking idiot, dude. What a fucking My man's guy. got the lightest nuts of all time, dude. Mm-hmm. My man got some empty nuts. It was so funny to watch him skateboard across that stage, and it's like anyone could do that. Yeah, he, I he just stay. It looks like he was pushed on. <laughs> yeah, the, yeah, he wasn't even like kicking. Like mm-hmm. he was just yeah, he was just stationary with his arms in like a T. And then there's like a video of like Andrew Yang doing like a fucking nine hundred. No, Andrew Yang's yeah, but he was sicker at skating for sure. Mm-hmm. He can skate. He yeah. can do everything. Nice dude. Did you see the hot young Yang pics? He's not that hot, dude. Ninety three Yang. He looked good when he was when he was dressed up as a he Dick looks cool as shit. He looked tight. He's, yeah, he's a cool guy. Yeah, he's cool. The Dead Kennedys pick? When he's Maybe. In there was like a, in college, like a college, yeah. Yang. he was he like, cool. uh, yeah. He had like cool hair. Yeah. Okay. Andrew Yang Young. What's his wife look like? Probably uh, the hottest chick ever, bro. <laughs> oh, yeah, he does look kind of cool. Let me see. When he's got like a fucking trench coat and shit. Yeah, dude, it's sick. Yeah, he looks kind of cool. I gotta be yeah, honest. Yeah, real college. Yeah, rock, I remember dude, people sharing, sharing that picture, being like young Andrew Yang. I'm like, that's funny. And then I saw Andrew Yang be like, "Yep, well, it's going around." Here's me in high school, and I was like, "Holy shit, <laughs> he's cool." Yeah, he's cool. Because <laughs> I mean, even like Barack Obama looked like a fucking nerd. Yeah, Barry. Yeah, he looked like Pharrell. He was in the Chum Gang though, dude. He smoked loud. Is that what the, is that what Chuming means? Him and his boys called themselves the Chum Gang. <laughs> That's pretty cool. That's Adam cool. loves to vac Chum up men's Chum. No, it's, <laughs> shut up. He loves to do mm-hmm. lines of cum of Chum. Adam <laughs> likes to dry up cum and then one. chop it into a dust. <laughs> <laughs> He's like, I'm getting high off Chum. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, that's what you that'd be great, dude. Just, the Republicans should make a law that it's illegal to have sex with a woman after the, <laughs> <laughs> the age four. That would be great. For, you should run, dude. That should yeah, be your platform. That, yeah, Andrew Yang shit. Yeah, yeah. He's gonna make all the toilets uh, into Toto uh, bidets. Mm, that's right. I was mad when we did that Andrew Yang whisper song last time around that it didn't have. It in me to riff out an entire song about Andrew Yang trying to introduce women to anime, <laughs> <laughs> and it's uh, "Wait do you see a Mac?" Wait do you see this Mac? Wait do you see a Mac? Hey baby girl, have you? Uh, do you know about robots? Let me whisper in your ear. <laughs> tell you something about a giant robot. <laughs> 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 you know. 
I don't, um, I don't. I certainly didn't. I mean, that would be a lot of mental work, and I'm. Yeah, I don't have it today, there's no dude. reason to do that, man. Come on, don't fucking work. Yeah, Go no, back. I do work. I mean, I'm exhausted today, but uh, last would, time around, what'd you do today? Now that my head just hurts and I don't feel yep. well, Damn, I feel man. much better than I felt yesterday. Good. We're Take like it away. Opposites, dude. Why don't you do some riffs for us? Okay. Um. So it's a pimp. He goes in a <laughs> Home Depot parking lot. He's like, hey, baby, you work for me now. <laughs> you should have just kept riffing that out. I know. Oh, I it wanted was your approval. Come to me for my I know. Oh, I was dude. like looking over at you because you were drive, drawing on your iPad. And I was like, Dad, I finally got a fucking hit in T-ball. <laughs> and you're not even watching. No. You, you, you're having an argument with another fucking dad. You just you set, you about set up a premise and you didn't riff it out. Yeah, I did think we were going to riff it for a little you gotta longer. You got to just keep went right to then. Nick. Well, what are the pimp things? I don't even know. It's um, too late now, man. He's okay, got fine. a pimp cup, maybe. A cup. Yeah. Yeah. cup. Orchata. There we go. Yeah, yeah. that's what yeah. they like. He's got orchata. He's got, yeah. <laughs> I do remember in Austin. <laughs> and in Austin, I would see it. There was a soda for Mexican guys, like like apple and Hi pineapple. Uh, uh, apple and pineapple soda and shit. Yeah, yeah. And the brand name. Okay. Do you know what I'm going to say? No. <laughs> I mean, I may have told this story before. I don't know. No, just no man. He, he didn't. I apologize. Mm. I get too Haritos. excited. Haritos. Yeah, that's the joke I was going to... I was going to point out the brand of soda that everyone knows about. Isn't that hilarious? Not everyone. We have some listeners in Australia. Anyways, the company... <laughs> the name of the company was P-E-N-A-F-I-E-L. Hell yeah. And I feel... Yeah. Pantophile. <laughs> and do you have a pantophile soda? <laughs> <laughs> that shit used to get me so good.